All right, guys, good morning. Day two, Mr. G in Slovenia. It is even colder than yesterday. It's like 20 degrees Fahrenheit, or like minus seven Celsius. I don't know, do the conversion on that. We are at Ljubljana Castle today. Um, I just said castle, I meant castle. It's like a 13th century fort. It's been added to over the years. And I would show you Ljubljana because it's right down there, but it's super cold and foggy, so you cannot really see much of it at all. I made the mistake of not wearing real gloves, of hobo gloves, and I'm so cold. Oh, the tropics. I'm missing the tropics right now, but no. City's super cool, uh, frosty, and did I mention it was cold? It's cold. All right, there it is. Ljubljana Castle, you've seen it. If I learn any history stuff, uh, I'll put it in the description. I'm lying, I probably won't. All right, let's see what's next. All right guys, rare appearance, Mrs. G with Mr. Hello. G. We're in a castle, <laughs> we're really cold. We're gonna go get some coffee. All right guys, we made it to the top of the tower in the castle of Ljubljana and it's super foggy and cold today. So this is what you get of the city right now. And Mr. G is super out of breath because I just packed baby G up the stairs to the top of this castle thing. So most of this castle is a mixture of like 12th century construction, some older 1st century Roman construction, and then lots of just modern stuff. It's like a modern art museum down there that they've built into the courtyard of this thing. Um, but right now, I need to get little G's and Mrs. G. We're gonna get down out of this thing and, uh, I don't know, go explore some more of the city. So that's the idea. If you can see way down there in the distance, we've got children ice skating. How adorable is that? All right, guys, you know you're in the Balkans if you can find chivapi, sausage, flatbread, onions. And then we've got like the ground up pepper stuff, and it's awesome, and it's everywhere. So you know you're in old Yugoslavia if they have chibati. Don't forget the fried cheese bread. All right, guys, no European trip would be complete without Museum of Modern Art stuff. Uh, art? More art. Extra modern-y art. Even more art. Uh, definitely modern art. Okay, this art would be really good for hanging clothes on to dry. As you guys can tell, I'm definitely a connoisseur of modern art. Is it art? Is it a game of Tetris? Or is it a screensaver for your computer? Okay, I actually like this one. Entitled, The Cyclops. Alright guys, so this is a district you find in Ljubljana well past the train station and the backpacker district and the hostels and it's like this art commune whole block of just art stuff because it got taken over by art students in like 91 and so you can see it's all about just free expression art graffiti which was a big deal after the fall of yugoslavia and slovenia getting independence in 91 so yeah basically a bunch of these art hippie students just squatted on the thing for like I don't know, 25 days, 30 days, until the city decided to just give it to them. So, there you go. There's that. And, uh... And me! You, no, little me. G, no, not you. You don't get me in here. No! All right, that's, that's it for day two in Slovenia. I'm little G when you're older. Mr. G out. <laughs>